Hello, and welcome to another Business Tech Planet video. Today, I'll be showing you a troubleshooting guide on how to fix Microsoft Teams tabs not loading. Let's get started. Firstly, let's try clearing the Microsoft Teams cache. To begin, make sure you close off Microsoft Teams if it's open, simply by using the Windows tray, as I do. Now, open up the Windows search bar. Type this out into the search bar and open up the cache folder. On your keyboard, press these two keys together to select all of these files at once. Right-click and simply select Delete. Give it a moment to delete the files, then see if this fixes the issue for you. Now, let's try updating Microsoft Teams. With Microsoft Teams opened up, select the three dots, as I have highlighted. From the drop-down list, click on Check for Updates. After initiating a check, you'll need to wait for some time for it to complete. You will see a message to confirm the checks are undergoing. Once this disappears, or if it says, we've updated the app, go ahead and restart the application and see if this fixes the issue. Next up, let's try uninstalling and reinstalling Microsoft Teams. Navigate to the Windows search bar and search for Microsoft Teams. Once you see it, right-click on it and select Uninstall. This will take you to your program's list. Use the search bar to find Teams. Once you see it, right-click on it and select Uninstall, then go through the uninstalling process. Once it has been uninstalled, navigate to the Microsoft Teams online page and click on Download Teams at the top. Then, click on Download for Desktop. Select the appropriate version for your Windows version. The download will begin, simply wait for it to download and go through the reinstalling process and see if the issue has been fixed. Finally, let's try updating a Windows installation. Open up the Windows search bar and type in update. Once you see check for updates, click on it. On this page, click on check for updates. Then, simply wait for the checks to be done. The check will run in the background without an issue, so you can go ahead and do other things if you desire, whilst you are waiting. Finally, click on where it says, Download and Install, and see if the issue is fixed once it is done. For a dedicated blog post on this topic, as well as other useful information, visit our blog post on our website. The link is in the description below. That's it for today's video. We hope this resolved your issue. Leave a comment down below if you ran into any issues, and subscribe for future tutorials if you haven't done so already. Thanks for watching.